Hello, today I would like to present you something that I believe is one of the best and with the nicest layout first aid kit that is designed for like a workplace and the lab environment. I have opportunity to take one of those into haul and that's because I'm going to be replacing it with a new one with a good expiration date. Of course, you've got absolutely no problem in purchasing a whole refill to get a new date on each element. And if you take a look, you've got the expiration date, as you can see. So we are going to be replacing it with a brand new. That's going to be my gain. But let's take a look what we've got. We've got actually two of those first aid station. Each of them is being under that plexiglass, so all the content is protected. And we've got a wide spread of different items that can help us in providing first aid kit. Since it is a lab environment, the most important part is a eye wash. Those are saline bottle with a special attachment that you can keep and pressing onto your eye and you can squeeze the bottle and remove any contamination. We also have got this spray that also can be used in your eye or to clean a wound. This is like a saline solution. There is a couple of things that are nice to mention. On bottom we've got a band-aid dispenser, of course under the plexiglass. And you can grab any of those band-aids, you can pull them down and easily attach. So you see, you make a quick pick and you know exactly which item to choose from. Those two bays are designed to take care of your eye if you've got a contamination. If you've got a big cat with a massive bleeding, then you are going to choose one of those two dressings. They are exactly the same and they are big one. You can apply them on your leg or onto your arm. If you've got like something small cut on your finger but bigger than require just a regular band-aid then you can choose one of those and they are exactly the same. Since it is a lab environment you can get burn and this is a burn kit. It is like a jelly wound dressing that you can apply on top. In case you need to clean up a wound, you can use the eye wash or those dedicated saline wipes. They are looks like this. You just tear it apart and it is like a wet towel that you can use for cleaning your wound. And just take a look how nicely you can pull the element that you need. You know exactly what to use when. Here inside we've got the CPR kit. We've got a face mask, gloves and the wipe that are being used for disinfecting. Those are not saline, I believe. They are being used for decontamination. And this is how it presents. Absolutely beautiful kit. I'm going to grab one home and we are going to take a look much closer. We are back on my desk, so I've got opportunity to show you that first aid kit station much closer. The first thing is it's screaming a high quality and I absolutely love it. The first aid station is divided into a three compartment. Two of them have got a clear window and around you've got a seal so it is protected from the environment so like a water droplet or dust they are not going to penetrate here you also have got it we've got a, another compartment over here and it's also protected with the seal most likely one of the most commonly used item is going to be just a band-aid for your finger and it's got a dedicated compartment. As you can see we've got a two different type of those band-aids. We've got a wide selection. We can use a waterproof, a regular one 
or very specialized for like a food processing plants and they've got a metal insert so if someone lose it then it's going to be beeping when metal scanning the the food so you can choose the one that you need and it is absolutely great because as you can see that part is protected you grab it you just pull it and after you do it one side is being uh, peel off and that's extremely important because it prevent people from taking them home so you are going to grab just one and it's going to be peel off on one end and you basically you do not have opportunity to steal it you are just going to be using as many as you need here you can see that you've got a first aid instruction so there are just a pictogram and they are going to describe you what to do so no matter which language are you using they are pretty universal that compartment is really nice because you can store over there items from a different company if you've got something that do not fit into those designated spot you can put it here in my case i've got a mouth to mouth kit this is what is going to protect you as a rescuer we've got a mouth mask we've got a gloves and we've got the decontamination wipes here we've got a key for replacing things like those band-aid you go and press it like this and then you can remove it this is also to prevent stealing and this is feared the biggest compartment everything is transparent so you know exactly what you are looking for and even if you never like pay attention then if you take a look at the pictogram you know that this one is for burn you can clearly see that you've got a fire it's going to cool you down here you can see that it's going to be for like a leg or arm here you can see four in one gauss absolutely great they are great i recommend you checking a online video because the manufacturer is showing you how to apply them and they are pretty universal if you decide to open set like this you are not only going to get that instruction but inside you've got a full fledge this is how it looks like so it is uh, extremely nice and i highly recommend you checking the manufacturer so let's take a look what they propose on the bottom we've got a burn kit this is a burn gel and we've got a two like a towels that are filled with a gel and the gel you are going to apply to your burn and it's going to give you a nice sensation of cold but this is not a ice pack it's not going to be magically cooled down but it's going to give you that feeling and yeah it is absolutely great so for the electronic lab if you ever burn yourself with like a soldering iron then this is the way to go those four in one are reminding me very much a israeli combat gauss they are totally different they are for civilian market but it's little bit similar because you've got those roll of a uh, gauss and you can use it to create a pressure or to apply the wound dressing so it is a pretty universal i highly recommend you check their page and they are going to show you how to apply it because it is really good and you've got a uh, two spots where you can place them and here you've got like a mini dressing i don't think i've got one that is open and it is for like a small cut your finger something bigger than just a band-aid then you can go for it here is the model number recommend you checking the video and you've got three of them in that area i've got things that are dedicated into cleaning your wounds this is not alcohol based they are not for disinfecting 
they are using a new knowledge that is going to tell you that you should not put alcohol or hydrogen peroxide to your cats because it complicates the process of healing because it's damaging the open edges of your skin and they are using that knowledge and it is like a saline solution so it's not going to create any any irritation and do not damage the skin and it is like a wipe you open it you brush it off and you are done of course you can get like a spray here is how it looks like and as you can see it can go into your eye and wound it is also a saline base totally safe and you can stick it like that so you've got a lot of opportunities to customize it to fit your needs here we can walk through some basic refill that you can select and we've got this four in one that i presented you we've got our wound cl wound cleanser those are that wet wipes with the saline solution i do not have those soft foam bandage but they are absolutely great and they are adhering to itself but not to your skin absolutely absolutely great if you need to remove them this is the four in one this is what we've got we've got the breathing mask that is inside of the protection kit here we've got our a and wound spray that i show you here we've got a lot of different eye wash the smaller one can be fit without problem over there so if that's your need you can select it and here we've got a different plaster the different band-aid and you can detect here is the detectable just like i told you for a food plants processing we've got a burn gel spray which i do not have we've got the burn cover this is what we've got this is what i've got over here we've got the burn gel so the barn cover i do not have it maybe it's time to order it and check it out so this is how it presents in my personal opinion this is one of the best first aid kit that are nicely laid out and even if someone is totally unfamiliar by following those pictograms he know which item to select to give a person uh, the best care so thank you very much for watching i hope you find it interesting see you next time and bye bye